off and run in tonight's late model main event. It's going to be Gundecker winning the race into turn number one. And it'll be Mark Bergtorf leading lap number one, followed by Gundecker, Reed, and Woodworth. Well, this is the 33 of Bergtorf getting gone here in the early going. Gundecker, Reed, and Woodworth, your top four. Well, Bergtorf had to have a straightaway advantage over Gundecker, Reed, Woodworth, and Jason Perry, your top five. Jamie Wilson takes a look under Kirkham. He'll have the spot down the back stretch. Rich Bell riding that high line off turn number four. Oh, Bell hopping the car bad into turn number one. Lucky to keep it on all four. Well, Jason Perry picking away underneath Denny Woodworth. Perry now putting the pressure on the 1ST of Justin Reed for that third spot. The 155, Jamie Wilson closing on Woodworth off turn number four. Mark Torf works around the outside of Gallagher and join a straightaway advantage over Gundecker. Long way back to that battle for third as Jason Perry, Denny Woodworth continue to race door to door. Well, Bergdorf working outside of Ginnenbacher off turn number four. Trouble. Terry Gallagher exits the speedway. We'll head to the pit area. And trouble to 155. Jamie Wilson exits the speedway down in turn number one. Well, Denny Woodworth finally able to get away from Jason Perry. Now the 21 of Rich Bell closing on a 1ST of Reed off of turn number four. Well, Rich Bell finally able to work away around Justin Reed for position. They continue to battle door to door as our race leader, Mark Bergtorf, looking for a way around.
Well, the laps continue to wind down. Only 11 to go this time by the flag's head as Burke Turf continues to dominate tonight's action. But Bergtorf working on putting the fifth place machine of Rich Bell a lap down. Bell continuing to fight to stay on the lead lap. Denny Woodworth, Jason Perry continue to round out our top four. six laps to go six laps remain Jason Perry once again closing on Woodworth for that third spot Well, Gundecker hung up behind the 1ST of Reed, allowing Denny Woodworth to close the gap. Well, Justin Reed drops to the bottom of the speedway to give our leaders a room up top. Dragon Air, one to go for Bergdorf. Jason Perry staying just a few car lengths off the Woodworth back bumper as we cross under the white flag. Checker, flag and air off of turn number four. It's going to be Mark Bergdorf getting his first feature win of the season with us here this evening. Gordy Gundecker, a strong run, brings it home with a runner-up finish, followed by Denny Woodworth. Jason Perry across in the stripe, fourth and the 21 of Rich Bell rounding out our top five. Everybody here knows no stranger to this spot on the front stretch. That and, year. and <laughs> well, lately this year. And neither is this car. And from what I've been reading uh, about a week or so ago, everything kind of changed and switched around. And you got thrown into the opportunity to run for Rick and those guys and what do you think about that? We brew a, broke a rod in our car a couple weeks ago and uh, I was just ready to set out the rest of the year and Rick said uh, if you want a car to drive it's open so I need to thank Rick Frankel and Colleen Frankel the owners of the car it's just getting better and better we ran Friday night at Granite got second and tonight it just got better and it's just one of those cars you got to keep your foot in and I was having a little trouble with lap traffic but if you keep your foot in it goes but I need to thank his crew Tony Warner and uh, Andy Mann that came from my crew and everybody that helps me and everybody that helps Rick all our sponsors together uh, hopefully it'll be a good team here shortly sounds like one hell of a team effort right there and we all know you're no stranger to keeping your foot in it so hey congratulations uh, any sponsors you want to thank tonight uh, all Rick sponsors Extreme Machines, which he owns, Denny Woodworth. I know he has some more on there. Um, Kate, Just new to the gig, right? Yeah, new, new to the gig. Uh, he offered to put my sponsors on the car. I think we'll have something going there lately, later. And uh, Casey's General Stores, Rick's Transit, Summit Tire, uh, Turner Brothers Garage, Jim City Ford. 
everybody that continues to help me. Uh, we're going to pitch in together and make this one go faster. Right on. Thanks for putting on a good show. Appreciate it.